The presidential candidate of Accord Party, Christopher Mumole, has laid out his blueprint for the total revolution of Nigeria's educational system if elected as president come 2023. He spoke at the convocation ceremony of the Joint Professional Training Support International Institute, a trailblazing institute of higher learning in Abuja. Habib Alawa reports. The decline in the quality and standard of education in Nigeria over the last two decades have resulted in Nigeria being the primary source of pupils from Africa who go to other countries in pursuit of a better education. When Nigerian students study abroad, they often perform admirably. Education in Nigeria is underfunded across all branches of administration. For example, in 2020, Nigeria's education budget at all times of government was much lower than the 26% suggested by the United Nations. Many have blamed this on poor governance in Nigeria. They say it has also impacted every other area of the economy, making education a particularly difficult industry to navigate. The solution and the lasting solution to end this strike in tertiary education is ensuring that more private sector get in, en engaged in, in tertiary education. Open it up and give more license. To, and when you do that, you know what you have done? You would have created a competition among private universities and that by itself would crash the tuition fee. Private universities will start charging 100000 for tuition fee. We have seen this happen everywhere in the world and it can happen in Nigeria. At the Joint Professional Training Support International Institute Convocation, a situation where schools are shut for several months because lecturers are often on strike over issues of better working conditions is not a model students hope for. I encourage any student that is at home currently, you don't have to wait. You don't even know when they are going to call off this strike. So why don't you just enroll in something that you still get the same result at the end of the day? Because time waits for nobody. The more you stay, the more you get older, the more time goes. Why don't you just uh, let go of that and while you wait, just get an alternative. JPTS is not just an online uh, program because we had physical exams, we had physical classes. The online program is a good one because um, it doesn't um, keep you at home like the, the, now the ASU, ASU, ASU is on strike. Uh, but we, I will, education continue, you understand? So it's a very good program. The educational system in Nigeria is no exception to the effects of corruption which permeates every facet of governance. Habida Lawal, TVC News, Abuja.